What is up guys, welcome back to the Papa Hacker Learning Channel featuring your host Papa Hacker Bro. But seriously though guys, today's video is going to be absolutely extra special and today we're going to be talking about the absolutely brand new Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019 and in support of this I will be giving away to every single person who hits that like button 7,000 fully automatic assault rifles. That is right guys, if you hit that like button you will be getting 7,000 fully automatic assault rifles. That is right guys, no lie, no scam whatsoever, they will all be mailed to you but obviously it will all be legal but if you guys do already have 7,000 fully automatic assault rifles I ask you to please go ahead and hit that like button anyway Papa, but guys today's video is mostly just to clear up most of the rumors and most of the fake leaks about Call of Duty Modern Warfare I know guys I know what fake news going around on the internet fake news going around on YouTube I know guys it just as surprising to me as it is all of you guys but here on the Papa Hacker learning channel we only strive to spread the truth so guys the absolute biggest rumor going around around right now which it's ridiculous it is absolutely ridiculous that call of duty decided to name their brand new game their brand new game for 2019 call of duty modern warfare that is right guys it is an absolute copy of the game that came out in 2007 it is an absolute copy of the game that came out in 2016 but guys it's actually a brand new game it has nothing to do with the other two games besides the title and guys the reason behind this is call of duty the geniuses at call of duty headquarters did not want to name the game call of duty modern warfare 4 because they felt that that would be too close to Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. So they decided just to take the 4 out altogether and somehow decided that that would be a lot more clear that this is a completely new game than to just name it Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4 like everyone was expecting. But guys, I imagine that they had a really good idea behind this. I imagine that Call of Duty knows their player base. They know their player base when it comes to Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Most of their player base wasn't even born when Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare came out. So they figured no one who plays our game is actually gonna get it confused but heads up guys everyone thought it was a reboot all right guys so besides them having a really dumb name for the game like honestly they couldn't have picked a more stupid name for the new call of duty game honestly guys call of duty hello kitty island would have been a better name all right guys the most exciting thing about call of duty modern warfare coming out in 2019 is going to be cross-platform compatibility that is right guys every single person playing call of duty modern warfare is going to be able to play together whether you're playing on xbox whether you're playing on your mom's laptop whether you're playing on your toaster, whether you're playing on your microwave, every single person is going to be able to play together. That is right, guys. Every single person playing Call of Duty is going to be in the exact same servers, playing the exact same lobbies. Now, guys, I know what you're thinking, but Papa, but Papa, if I'm playing on my Xbox, aren't I going to lose every single time to people playing on their toasters? All right, guys, calm down, calm down. Don't worry. The way matchmaking is going to work, it's pretty simple. Let me explain it to you. It's called input style matchmaking. Now, let me break that down for you guys so it's going to put you in a lobby based off what your input style is meaning if you're playing with a controller it's going to try to put you in lobbies where people are playing on controllers if you're playing with a keyboard and mouse it's going to try to put you in a lobby with people with a keyboard and mouse if you're playing with your mother's dildo you should probably put it down but if you're on your phone and you're playing with someone on their toaster it's going to put you in a combination of the two just because of the input styles and trying to keep it fair for everyone it's not going to let one person be playing on their phone and everyone else's playing with a keyboard unless you know you and your friend are playing on separate devices and you both join a lobby together then obviously one of you guys is going to have something different than everyone else but guys if this does truly take off and every single AAA title from here on out becomes cross-platform that is actually going to help with bullying that's going to stop school bullying that is right guys it actually might stop your pressure into buying different consoles now this is truly exciting because you will no longer be required to have the same console as your friend and be playing the same games together that means you can play on whatever you prefer and you can still play with other people online because guys I am absolutely 100% sure every single person watching this video right now has been bullied at least once in their lives whether it's your friends trying to peer pressure you into buying the same console as them because that's the one they prefer or getting made fun of because you're stupid and ugly but seriously though guys I know I have been bullied before and I'm pretty sure every single one of you guys have been bullied into trying to buy a console that your friend has or you've been bullying other people because you want them to buy the same console that you have but guys on a serious note if you are being being bullied please reach out to someone reach out to your parents reach out to your teacher reach out to the toaster above the bathtub but seriously guys if you are bullied good things do come of it most great people have been bullied as a child albert einstein was bullied as a child barack obama was bullied as a child i was bullied as a child and look what happened to me i went on to become a successful minecraft youtuber and i'm sure something great can happen for you guys as well but if you're still being bullied as an adult it's probably because you're watching 
watching Bob Hacker on YouTube. All right, guys. So another absolutely ridiculous rumor I have been reading about a little bit on Reddit was that the new Call of Duty game will require a monthly subscription in addition to the subscription you're already paying for on Xbox, on PS4. PC doesn't have a monthly subscription because people on PC are really cheap and pirate all their games anyway. But they're trying to get one on there as well. But guys, I can 100% say that there will not be a monthly subscription. Now, this was 100% confirmed with the Call of Duty Season Pass. That is right, guys. Call of Duty announced that they will no longer be doing the Season Pass for the brand new Call of Duty game because they want to roll out updates at the same time for every single platform. And I'm definitely crossing my fingers now, but they said that they were all going to be free. I just really, 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 really hope, Call of Duty, that you do get rid of loot crates because loot crates are probably one of the absolute worst things that they added to the game. They completely destroyed Black Ops 4 with all of the useless updates that they pumped into the game. It basically just became a mix of Fortnite, CSGO, Grand Theft Auto 4, and a few other games that they just try to mash all into one game to try to get as much money out of the game as possible. And it completely failed and I really hope they don't screw up this game. Honestly, the absolute least that they put into the game is going to make it a better game at this point. All you need to do is put guns in the game, have people walk around, and please put enough guns in it. Don't just put like three guns and three map. Put a little bit of effort into it, but honestly, the least you put into the game Game, the best game's gonna be. All right, guys, so if you're watching the video still, I have some homework for you. Please go ahead, hit that like button, leave a little comment down in the comment section. Even if you don't like Call of Duty, leave a comment down in the comment section about how you don't like Call of Duty and let me know what you think the best part about the game's gonna be, what the worst part about the game's gonna be, or if you just don't even play Call of Duty. But I want you guys all to jump on Twitter. I want you to share this video with your friends. And if you guys do want more Papa Hacker keeping you updated with leaks and rumors going on around YouTube, go ahead hit that subscribe button and guys down in the comment section go ahead let me know what device you're going to be playing the brand new call of duty on i know i'm going to be playing it on my toaster preferably while i'm taking a bath my hands are going to get kind of slippery i might drop it in the tub but guys if you did enjoy this video please go ahead hit that like button hit that subscribe button and have a great day